Hey yo, I'm Caleb Scargle. I'm here at the CFXU radio station, 93.3, and we get ready for another lit interview. <laughs> Alright, I am here with Luke. Luke, give me your full name. My name is Luke Letourneau, if anyone's wondering. Can we look you up on YouTube? Uh, you can uh, You can look me up on SoundCloud. I'm soundcloud.com slash letourneautables. L-E-T-O-U-R-N tables with a Z. Um, uh, you hear that? That's fancy. You can look that up. It's a little fancy. Uh, yeah, yeah, that's where you can find me for now. Other than that, I'm just, I'm just chilling. And remind me, Luke, who are we gonna do in this year? I'm in Riley Hall with this, with this lovely gentleman right t next to me, and also with the gentleman holding the camera. <laughs> and I'm uh, directly behind uh, whoever's watching this. <laughs> you hear that? He's a royal. All right. And uh, remind the audience, what song did you play at the uh, the town show? I played a tune by a little unknown artist named Taylor Swift. It's called Shake It Off. Now you're getting real up and close and personal with this mic, eh? Oh, yeah. Yeah, he does the deal. You know? <laughs> you know what you kind of. the mic. You got, yeah, you're a beast in there. <laughs> so, what inspired you to play, you know, Shake It Off? I gotta know. Well, I mean, I mean, like, it's a song that people know, it's a song that's fun to sing. And. You know what? My girl Taylor Swift wrote a good track. She did. She did. I mean, she had a little help, but she wrote a good track. Yeah. It's off the album 1989, if anyone's wondering. Um, uh, some good tracks on there. You a big, you a big fan? Uh, I like a few. What do they call Taylor Swift fans? I don't know. Um, S Swift? Sh Swifties? No. Swifties? No, I don't know. What, what do they call them? I don't know. I have no idea. No, Kanye I don't know. haters. That's what they call them. Oh, really? Oh, I always forget about that. You heard about Taylor vs. Kanye night we had last year? Oh, no, I didn't. I did not. That would be pretty... What, is it like Taylor Swift fans versus Kanye West fans? Yeah. Is that the end? I might, I might have to go with Yeezy on that one, though. <laughs> Dang, <laughs> even though, traitor. Even, even though I, like, I mess with... Oh, I was about to swear there. I mess with um, Taylor Swift's um, Shake It Off. I have to say, overall artistry, respect the artistry, quote by Kanye West, um, uh, I think Kanye West takes the, takes the throne. He's, he's, he's been watching he's, yeah. the throne, he's been if watching you know what I'm saying. All right, let me ask you something. Let me hear your music story. When did you start? How long you been playing? Oh, I've, been, uh, I've been playing for several years. Um, I started playing guitar when I was about 16 years old. Then I started playing. I started playing piano before that, and um, started writing songs when I was about seventeen. Yeah, yeah. Seventeen, huh? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Seventeen thirty-eight. Are you down with Fetty Wap? Uh, I don't know. Is that a, is that a song by Fetty Wap? That's. Are you a Remy boy? What? No, you're not. You're <laughs> not woke. He's not I don't, woke. I know. I know trap queen. I know trap queen. That's all I you're know. You're a trap queen. Am I? Oh. <laughs> yep. Anyways, yo, okay, if you're not listening to Fetty Wap, I gotta know what's on your iPod right now. What's your, like, what's your three songs that you're listening to right now? Three songs? Oh, I gotta check. Oh, he's pulling it out. Check. The first artist to pull out his phone. <laughs> he wants um, to be sure. Okay. They're all gonna be... Well, a lot of his jazz music, a lot of his jazz music right now. That's okay. Uh, so, a track I have right now that I'm listening to the most is, um, Watermelon Man by Herbie Hancock. It's his version off of Headhunters. It's it's a really, really, really funky song. Um, I'm also listening to, I don't know, man. K like Kendrick, a lot of people okay, listen to yeah, that. We have another Kendrick. Okay. Yeah. You like Dan? I do like Dan. I do like Dan. I like Section 80. Shout out to the old school Kendrick. Yeah. Yeah. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. And, yo, I saw you at the bar last night. Oh, but where can we catch you in the future? Are you planning to do more gigs? Why are you keeping me on my edge like this? Well, well, funny you say that. Mm -hmm. um, I'm playing tomorrow at the Bauer Theater in the Green Room. We're doing a cabaret. It's a night at the movies. Mm. So I'm going to be playing a couple songs that have to do with movies. Uh, one of which 
is by Prince, and it's from a movie. And I'm not gonna name the song because you're gonna yeah, have to come and see it. it. Like, I mean, <laughs> Did you hear that? Yeah. Is it Purple Rain? Don't say. It. Don't uh, lie. I don't. No. Don't react. Freeze. All right. You're cool. All right. So what do you? Okay. Let me give you a hypothetical. There's a kid. He looks like you. He's not your twin, but you know he's been playing the guitar since 16. He's been playing the piano since he was, you know, like four or whatever. But he's too nervous to come down to the Fox or perform. What do you What do you say to him? How do you encourage him? Just like, I don't know, just just practice a lot, and when it's really, really, really like, when you're confident. He's when already as good as you. He, he's oh, almost better. Oh, just just get out of there, man. Like like if you if if you mess up, you mess up. If you fail, you fail, and then you can try again. I mean, <laughs> that's all you can really do. Like if if you do it. <laughs> And you didn't do as well as you wanted to do, then you can just do it again. <laughs> you hear that, haters? It's, it's, yeah, yeah. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's Simple. that. You know, you want to be like him? That's what you do. <laughs> First. <laughs> you All right. Me. Yo, I'm Caleb here with Luke. Luke, thanks for coming down. You give like a great interview. Hey. Right? Am I right? I I hope you're right. Um. I'm not going to gas myself up too much, but I think I did a pretty good job. Yeah. He's next, ladies and gentlemen. All right, thanks, Luke. Thank you. All right. And thank you to the Fox for having me here.